Hey there, car enthusiasts, today, we're tackling the PO335 code. This error code signals a malfunction in the crankshaft position sensor circuit. But don't worry, I'll guide you through diagnosing and fixing it step by step. The OBD decode PO335 is a generic diagnostic trouble code that stands for crankshaft position a circuit malfunction. The code is set when your car's primary computer also known as the powertrain control module PCM is unable to detect a signal from the crankshaft position sensor. Before we start swapping parts, let's confirm that the PO335 code is accurate by scanning the vehicle system. I'm using my OBD scanner to pull the diagnostic codes. Faulty or damaged crankshaft position sensors, wiring issues, failed ECM, timing, belt, chain problems, and mechanical issues such as worn or damaged crankshafts. Check engine light is on, engine stalls or hesitates, engine bucks or stumbles at road speed, hard starting or no start, engine misfire, rough running. A multimeter, OBD to scanner, socket set, a replacement crankshaft position sensor if needed, and don't forget safety gear, like gloves and goggles. First, we need to locate the crankshaft position sensor. It's usually near the bottom of the engine, close to the crankshaft pulley. Check your vehicle's repair manual if you're having trouble before replacing anything. Always check the sensor's wiring and connector, look for any loose, damaged, or corroded wires, and make sure the connector is seated properly. If you find any visible damage, you may just need to repair or replace the wiring. You will finding it. Now, let's check the sensor. Using your multimeter, test the resistance between the sensor terminals. A functioning sensor typically reads between 200 to 900 ohms. If your reading is outside this range, the sensor may be faulty. Once the new sensor is installed, clear the PO335 code using your OBD to scanner. Now, start the car and check if the engine runs smoothly. Take it for a test drive to ensure the problem is completely fixed. And there you have it. That's how you diagnose and fix a PO335 code. Remember to always double check your work and consult your vehicle's manual for specific details. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more DIY car repair tips. Thanks for watching.